proud of myself. We just need like a bunch of like bathroom stuff um, because we don't have anything. Tomorrow's our last day here. Then we go to our new house. What's going on, muchachos? We are getting ready to do a bunch of errands. Are you gonna show them your hair? You're gonna show them? I am really impressed with myself, you guys, right now. So I'm gonna show you. Oh, God. Wow, you look so pretty. Let me see your hair. So this is my first time ever doing it, by the way, guys. It's not like perfect, but I did little like kind, try to do a little French braid, like going down in a braid yeah. and this side too. So, I mean, I need to just keep practicing. So it's more like tight to the head, but I'm proud of myself and I think it looks super cute. Do you like it, mamas? Yeah? I thought it was a little good. Keep it out of her face, but then also turn around, gorda. You can see how long, look at this you guys. Look how long and beautiful her hair is. I love it, gordas. Where are you going? Let me, let's see long. Oh, you're gonna go see how long it is? Is it long? Yes. Yes? Like you. <laughs> like me? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and Rapunzel? Yeah. Yeah. Professor yeah. have long hair? Yeah, she has really long hair. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I'm pretty proud of myself. I've, I've like waited to like be able to like do a laundress hair. We're going! But she doesn't really like usually allow me to play with her hair or do her hair. But she said she wanted me to do her hair and I was like, score! So I tried something new and different. I need to get on like my sister-in-law um, candy. She does French braids so freaking good. She does hair really good in general. I need to get on like that level, but I'm, I'm getting there slowly but surely. But for now, Edam is home. It's 2.46 and we are gonna go and do, it feels like we're gonna be saying he's home in a hotel, but this is this is home. Show papa. Um, but only for one more day. Show papa, show papa. <laughs> but um, we, me too, I really wanna cut my hair. Not Nothing crazy, y'all. But um, anyways, do you have a key? I have all of them. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, that's right, we have to go and really check back in. But um, anyways, we are going to go do a bunch of errands. We are going to go to the, oh yeah, it doesn't work. Oh. <laughs> um, we're gonna go, this is blurry. We're gonna go to the post office to officially change our address. I was like online all day today, like oh, updating credit cards coming. and things. Someone's coming. Ooh, that stinks. Ooh, that smells really bad. It's right. So yeah. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go to the post office and just do that in the system and then we're also gonna go check out Did you find a Ross or TJ Maxx? Yeah, I found You did? Okay, we're gonna go there They're to check out like party. shop. Oh, of course. They're like far away. Which one's the closest? Hopefully. I don't know. But anyways, so yeah, we're gonna go there because we need to get shower curtain, shower liner. We need to get a mop. We need to get shower hooks. We need to get a bunch of stuff. And like, I don't know why all that crap is so expensive. So we're gonna go there just to like see how much. Like even on Amazon, Target's website, like everything seems so expensive. I was like, really? 20, 30 dollars for a shower curtain? Why? But anyways, first we need to go recheck back in because I don't know why, but that's what we have to do. All right, stop number one, the post office. At stop number two, and look who is asleep. Oh, by the way, look how cute her little hamburger earrings are. <laughs> and for our second stop, if you can see behind the trees, we are gonna check out Ross. And I noticed across the street there is a Marshalls and a Home Goods, which actually works out really well because I wanted to see if there was a Home Goods. So we'll check out there next. So um, I don't know if we're gonna buy anything, but I mean, if it's a really good deal, then probably we will. But we just need like a bunch of like bathroom stuff um, because we don't have anything. So far, we're doing pretty good, muchachos. I'm pretty impressed. So we got a couple of things, but I'm not gonna show you guys, sorry, because I am going to be doing a haul and show you guys like everything that we get and a lot of you. What an ass. I know how to blur now, that's true, so I could blur it out. But maybe, because it was funny, maybe I will leave it. Anyways, so yeah, I'm gonna look at the sheets and see what they have for sheets to see if they have the theme that Alondra wants, because if they do have it, maybe get it here, maybe. But I also need like her size and stuff. This is super cute, babe. Ooh, this is really cute. And this is cheap, but this is not her size. Mwah, of course. Neither is this. This is super cute too. But all right, anyways, I'm gonna do a little bit more shopping or at least looking around. Hey, you guys, do you watch the Shaws of Sunset? Look, they sell Asa's water here, the diamond water. They sell it at Ross if you are ever curious about it. Morning. Or not. 
right, well, while Edom tries to get Alondra out of the car because homegirl is not having it right now, we are at our next stop, which is Home Goods, but it says it's Marshall's Home Goods, and I thought Home Goods was a TJ Maxx Home Goods. Comment down below because honestly, it's driving me nuts, and I swear Home Goods is like part of TJ Maxx, or maybe Marshall's and TJ Maxx is all the same. I don't know. All I know is we're gonna go in there, and I'm really excited about the stuff that we already got. Uh oh, Meltdown Sorry. City, guys. Okay, we're leaving Home Goods. It was kind of a bust, honestly. It didn't have that much um, options. We only got three things, but at least it was three things that we needed. Gorda, we are not doing McDonald's. Sorry, honey, but that is coming to an end. Okay, well, we can discuss that later. First, let's get you in the car. How about that? How about that? Oh God, here we go again. Do you guys see this ish right now? TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Ross. I don't know if you guys can see all three, but literally when Edam and I were on like the like the maps on our phone, it didn't even show a Ross and a TJ Maxx next to each other because we were looking first for a Ross. What baby? Oh, you want to show muchachos? Wow, what is that, Mamas? You're gonna give it to everyone? Oh, okay. All right, come on, let's go inside this door. We had to make a quick stop at Chick-fil-A because she was like really hungry and she was. She actually ate her fries and her nuggets, which usually never happens. But anyways, when we were looking on the maps, it didn't show any of the stores next to each other. So we literally drove like 20 minutes out to this, this, this TJ Maxx and look, a TJ Maxx and a Ross are next to each other and Home Goods. And I was like, well, this is good. We can go to all three stores. Edom's like, you seriously, you're gonna go to all three stores? I'm like, yeah, honey, they all have different stuff. So. But anyways, yeah, we're gonna, oh, I got the keys, so I got, are you in here, stroller? Okay. But anyways, yeah, so we're gonna go check it out. But I mean, so far, we're getting, we're getting some stuff, but we just um, need to get a few more, th well, actually, there's a lot more that we need to get, but, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say is. We, we need more stuff, basically, is the bottom line. Okay, so I wasn't crazy. Home Goods is a part of TJ Maxx. Okay, we are home from all of our errands. It is currently, it's like 7.14, I was gonna say, yeah, and we missed happy hour, dang it. But, Mama, oh well. I missed happy hour. You what? I missed happy hour. You missed happy hour? Well, that was our last one we could have done. Nope. Yeah, huh, because they don't have happy hour tomorrow. And guess what? Tomorrow's our last day here. Then we go to our new house. You excited? You look so cute. I hate the hotel. You hate the hotel? Yeah. We know we're gonna go to the the house tomorrow. But I want the mama right house, but I don't want to move here. Oh, I know, baby. So yeah, so we miss happy hour. So that's a bummer, but oh well, I guess we have that one dinner we can heat up from Costco. That big one, we can heat that up and eat it since we uh, missed out on our free dinner tonight and free beer. And yeah, tomorrow, so huh? Free beer. I know, well, you saw some in the fridge. But tomorrow we get to go, well, we're not gonna stay the night at our new place because we're not gonna have our stuff. But I'm so excited because we get the keys. So as soon as Edom gets off of work tomorrow, we are headed straight there. I'm gonna like load up the car and like bring all of our stuff over and just like, well, I guess we don't have to do it tomorrow, but doesn't really matter tomorrow Saturday. I think we still have the hotel until the 16th. So it doesn't really matter, but I don't know. I'm just really, 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 really excited. And then Saturday we'll have our stuff. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. We're supposed to call Edom tomorrow to set up a time, but you miss your bed? Yeah, actually I need to look at stuff like that. Cause I need to see what stuff we didn't buy. And I can't show you guys number one, because well, it's still in the car. And number two, well, you have to wait for that you call. Hungry? And that's gonna be a separate sit down video. Huh? I could eat. You want this? Yeah, and whatever we don't eat, we can put it in Tupperware, you can take to work, or I can eat tomorrow. So. But anyways, yeah, we're home now, so we're gonna get settled, because we just walked in the door, and um, yeah, figure out what we're gonna do for dinner, since, you know, we missed, we missed our free meal. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't even looked at myself. It's the next day, muchachos. It, it's 6.54 a.m. I've been awake maybe for like 20 minutes. I can't sleep. And I went to bed late last night and yeah. <sighs> I don't know what's wrong with me, you guys. I cannot sleep. Edom said like maybe I'm stressed and I have a lot on my mind, but I know when I'm stressed and I'm not stressed. 
Like, I'm not stressed about anything. I'm excited. Like, I mean, I hope all of our stuff comes in, like, on Saturday. Like, and nothing's broken, nothing's damaged. Like, no issues, but I'm not, like, stressed. I don't know. I'm excited as all hell today. Like, I'm excited for Friday, which is today, because we get our keys. Like, I'm so freaking excited. But I don't feel stressed or worried about anything. I just feel like, yeah. So, I don't know. Maybe it's the excitement. But that can't explain, like, the past, what, two, three weeks? Like, I don't know, you guys. I think I'm going to buy some Z-Quil. Edom took Z-Quil before, and he didn't like it. Um, but I think I'm just gonna, like, buy some and try it because I am hating. But it's crazy, too. Like, I'm functioning throughout the day. I'm not tired throughout the day or anything. So, I don't know. It's really weird. But I want to get good sleep, regular sleep. Like, it's, it's good for you. Your body needs sleep. So, yeah. I don't know, you guys. But anyways, I'm gonna make myself some coffee. Got the coffee. We told them. It's so funny. They kept giving us like de like one decaf and one of these. And we're like, no, we don't like decaf. We want only these. But then for some reason, they stopped giving us coffee. Like, it's really weird. Like, they don't give us plates or silverware. They don't like restock like this kitchen area at all. Um, I don't know why. I don't know if it's because we have stuff like out on the table. But anyways, so the other night, Edom was like, went downstairs and asked for some coffee. And the guy was like, oh, we don't have any. But we like, had like made friends with like the kitchen people or whatever. But like, there's two ladies on it in the morning for breakfast and one that does the happy hour. And like, we see them every freaking day. So like, we talk to them. And so Edom went up to her and was like, you don't have any coffee back there, do you? And she's like, She's like, no. She's like, did you ask the guy up there? He was like, yeah. I said that all they have is decaf. And she's like, wait, housekeeping didn't leave any for you? And so Edom told her like, well, they never do. And he's like, and the lady's like, well, that, they should always be leaving you like coffee. So anyways, it doesn't really matter. We're not like mad about it. So she was just like, what's your room? I'll, I'll bring you, I'll bring you some. And Edom was like, okay. So gave her the room number and this is what she does. She was. she bring us the whole bag like this was two days ago so we've used a, like not a lot of the coffee but we've used it since then but i mean like you can't really see but this whole all this guys right here this is all coffee so it was just like funny because when she knocked on the door we were like oh my god and she's like that way you don't have to worry about if they're gonna leave you coffee or not which they didn't leave us coffee today they didn't leave us coffee yesterday either so <laughs> but it's just it was just kind of funny i'm worried i'm gonna make a lot of noise anyways i need to end the vlog that's why i got on here to vlog was to end the vlog thing but you guys already know how i am i am a rambler i am a talker not a rambler am i a rambler i'm just a talker okay i like to talk um so anyways I'm gonna go because I want to start editing the vlog that is supposed to go up today, Friday, and I want to get a jump maybe on Saturday's vlog because we never set up cable TV to internet, and um, well, I'm gonna need the internet. I keep saying cable TV, cable and TV is the same thing. Anyways, we never set it up, and well, we're gonna need to set it up. Well, one, because TV, and two, well, I do need internet, so. Anyways, we have the place until the 16th, the hotel, so I don't know if I'm just going to drive here and just utilize it. I don't know how that's going to work. But anyways, I'm going to go. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. I know it's probably like a tease to go shopping for apartment stuff, but then not show you apartment stuff. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to tease y'all, but I just really, 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 really want to do the haul. I feel like I don't ever get to do like apartment haul or like home decor haul, like any of that stuff. And I'm excited to do them because I love those kind of hauls. I love hauls in general. So I just want to save everything for the haul. And I'm like, eh, if you guys see it in the vlog, then you're not going to care to watch it in the haul is like what I'm thinking. I could be wrong. Um, but anyways, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go. Also, don't forget the Camacho Machacho merch did relaunch. So definitely check it out. The link is in the description box. There's different t-shirts, different colors, and I'm in love with them. And they are very, very soft. I like the quality. So get you some Camacho Muchachos merch if you want. Of course, they are available online until the 29th of October. I can try to see if there's a way to like extend it again, which I think there might be, but I have to double check. And um, there is a limit again. 
So like 11 shirts have to be, is it, yeah, it's 11. 11 shirts have to be sold um, before they actually print and ship. So if you're not, I know we have some new people on the channel. Um, so if you're interested in a merch shirt, a Camacho Muchacho shirt, basically 11 shirts have to sell. Once those 11 shirts are sold, that's when it's like, okay, the campaign, campaign is officially running. Like, I don't know if that makes sense. Um, you all seem to like get it last times, but I'm just like, I feel like I'm not explaining it properly right now. But, and then once the campaign ends, so the 29th of October, that's then when the shirts will print and then the company ships them. I don't ship them, the shirts are not already printed. They print and ship them, number one, after the minimum requirement is met, which is 11 shirts sold, and then also after the sale ends. So just letting you guys all know in case there's anybody that has any questions about any of that. But of course, if you have any questions about anything, definitely comment down below. I get a size medium. I don't, I only have two of the shirts. I'm actually gonna get the crew neck and I'm gonna get another unisex tee. I get the unisex tee. I like my shirts a little bit baggier on me and I get a medium. And the medium fits me good, but it also, you know, covers the bum and stuff like that lengthwise. So I like it. It's not tight on me. And then I also got the long sleeve tee and the medium as well. But I plan on getting the crew neck and another unisex tee. So anyways, yeah, those are the, the two shirts that I have in case you guys are wondering for like reference or size or anything like that. But okay, I'm going to go now. So anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. Please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video, which is really today. And we're getting the keys. I'm so excited. But all right, I will talk to you guys later. Bye, muchachos.